Welcome back to Swiss Watch Expo. This is Angel, and today we're taking a look at my three best picks for dive watches. Stick around. Welcome back to Swiss Watch Expo. This is Angel, and this week our top three picks are going to be from the dive category. I've picked my three favorite models in our entire collection. It was a very hard task to pick only three, but these are going to be the three that I choose for my favorite. Stick around for our stories and maybe see some of the runner-ups as well. So we're going to be taking a look today at two Planet Oceans, of course, or two Omegas, I should say. Uh, they are known for dive watches and this beautiful Submariner. So let's get right into it. So my first pick, I'll go right into the Planet Ocean Seamaster. This is done in white. I love the white ceramic on this. Typically, when you think of a Planet Ocean, you think of something with the black and with the orange. So I felt as though this was something that gave you a little different touch. And also, I love the fact that not only is the bezel on this in the white ceramic, but the dial itself is also ceramic. So I think that's a very nice touch. Uh, it helps for durability, corrosion, things of that nature. This watch is the perfect size at 40 millimeter. So not oversized to where a lady wouldn't be able to wear it if she wanted to, but still very substantial for a gentleman. The beautiful signature Planet Ocean bracelet on this and the broad arrow hands. These look amazing under low light with the contrast of the Super Luminova and the blue. This watch has been tested not only for COSC standards, but also for the medicine standards. So you're going to have a minus zero plus six on this. So tested in two ways very, very highly resistant to magnetism. You know, you typically think of the Milgauss when you think of a watch that's made for that, but Omega has a lot of really great brands that are very resistant to magnet, uh, magnets. So this is a great watch for everyday wear. You know, if you're going to be back and forth in and out of your pocket and picking up credit cards and cell phones and things of that nature, you don't have to worry if that's going to affect the mainspring, which will affect accuracy. This is going to be an uber accurate watch. Just beautiful for summer. I love the white. It's so beautiful. It's so bright. Great, great option for a dive watch this summer if you want something a little different. Also, of course, one of my favorite features on most watches is going to be the exhibition case back. And Omega does a great job of that, uh, executing that on the back with the screw down case back. So beautifully, beautifully done. And also very, very good for diving because it goes very deep, uh, deeper than your typical watch. I want to say this one goes to a little over a thousand feet. So uh, let me know down in the comments if you'll actually use it for that, that reason. Next up, we're going to take a look at the Rolex Submariner. Now I chose this one in particular because I love the steel and gold option. It really gives great versatility. This one, of course, has the uh, Cerachrome bezel, which is going to be the most durable bezel. The numbers will be etched in, so you don't have to worry about any fading or anything of that nature. And the other reason I chose this is because you get the Rolex factory diamonds on the dial. So more rare than your typical Submariner. Um, I think that's perfect for the person who wants the functionality but wants a little bling. This watch is beautifully done in 40 millimeters. You'll have that 18 karat gold done by Rolex in-house. They do all of their alloys there in-house. So it's going to be the best of the best and your signature oyster bracelet. A watch like this, you really can't go wrong with. It's perfect if you want to make a statement, but you don't want to be too bold, but you love your diamonds. I love this option in the Submariner category. So beautiful dive watch that'll take you from actually diving and swimming to dinner if you need it. And then last, but of course, certainly not least, is this beautiful Seamaster here. This is the Jacques Mayol dive watch. He is known for being, or he was known for being one of the best free divers in the world. And what you'll see here on the dial is the apnea dial, which basically gives you 14 minutes of dive time for free diving with 
no extra equipment or anything like that. So this will let you know you are pretty much getting there. And so essentially you will deploy it as you would a typical uh, chronograph watch by hitting the button here and then stopping it. We'll go ahead and stop that one and then you'll reset it. So we'll see the red jump back to silver in just a sec here. So that is the start of your 14 minute. Um, and let's go ahead and get it going again. You would just push that pusher here to show that the time is running out for you to stay underwater. I love the story behind this watch. I love the man behind this watch. I think he is one of the icons for diving. He uh, has a beautiful uh, documentary as well as books that he's written about uh, the aquatics and the apnea features of diving. So a great watch. I love this rubber strap here. This actually is a 42 millimeter watch. It actually feels very compact to be a 42 millimeter and just a great overall timepiece. I love the touch of red. I love the red here on the actual bezel. I love the etching around the bezel. I, I haven't seen any bezel that has that kind of cutaway like that. The satin and high polish finishes complement each other beautifully. And just a great watch for everyday wear, a great conversation piece. When you see that red start on the dial and you're having a great conversation with someone, their attention is gonna go right to it and ask you, hey, what's your watch doing? I've never seen that before. And you'll have a great story to tell. So three of my favorite dive watches for this summer. Uh, as I said, there were a few runner-ups that uh, couldn't make the cut, but these are the three top. Stick around and take a look at some of our stories and see some other options. Again, this is Angel at Swiss Watch Expo. Thanks for sticking around and we'll see you next time.